Hey guys, it's Emma, and today I'm going to be going over factoring using a difference of squares. So, let's, this is our first example, x squared minus 16. Let's look at them without the minus sign for a minute. Square root, this side, and this side. That's 4, 4, x, and x. So, let's set up our factors that way. x, 4, 4. Now, we got to bring back our negative friend. So, because it's negative, this actually makes this possible. If it were positive, that would mean that this would factor out wrong if both sides were positive. And then we would have a B number, but we don't have one here because it cancels out. So, instead of them both being positive, one is positive and one is negative because this number is negative. Now when we factor this out, there won't be a B number and it'll be identical to this one. And that's how you factor using a difference of two squares. Other example. I have over here. I lost my eraser. So... x squared minus 36. Same sort of thing. x, 6, x, 6, positive, negative. It doesn't matter which order the positive and negative are in as long as one of them is positive and one of them is negative. That way your B number cancels out and it'll look just like you started with. That's how you factor using a difference of squares.